Yes, you read that right. Y'all, it's over 45 pieces. Get comfortable. Y'all know one of my most favorite things to do on this channel is a clothing haul because I feel like I really, really get to show y'all more of my personality compared to, you know, hair, but hair is fun too. But I love, a love, love, love a good clothing haul. So she and reached out to me and asked me, could they send me a few pieces for a fall haul? And I said, you surely can because I literally have three orders coming in of fall based clothes. Why, why, why I do that to myself? I don't know. So what I decided to do was combine what they sent me with what I purchased into one mega huge video. So go get your snacks because this is going to take a while. Um, I'm going to try to organize it by category. So I'm going to try to do like sets, dresses, bottoms, tops, shoes, because y'all I even got some, some boots like three or four pair, I think. Um, as far as my size and go, if you're new here, first of all, click subscribe. But as far as my size and go, y'all, like I always tell you, I really don't know because I'm a huge thrifter. So I've never, I don't know what my size is. I fit in 12s, most 12s. Some 10s will go on, but they're gonna be a little tight. Uh, I'm always gonna introduce you or tell you in the introduction what size I got and you know, just look at my body and, and see how that works for you. Uh, you know, I'm gonna try this on all on no shapewear because I ain't finna bullshit you. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna be realistic in what you gonna get. That being said, when I'm doing the introductions and I'm telling you the size, I'm gonna be like, eh, this is gonna look so nice on me. But wait, because I might look like Boo Boo the Fool. Okay, wait for my voiceover because when I'm putting this video together, that's my first time actually seeing me seeing me in the clothes. Um, what else? I told you about the cucumber coat. Oh. Because this haul is so massive, my hair might change a little bit. If it does change, if you look in the description box, I put, I tell you what wigs I got on, but I'm feeling like I'm gonna have to multitask because this gonna be, this is a huge endeavor. All right, let's get started. Let's, let's, let's just jump into this. In my opinion, nothing screams fall like flannel, right? And plaid. So when I saw this set, I was like, ooh, I gotta have it. I got this set in a size extra large. Um, now I'm gonna be honest, this flannel oversized shirt is going to be perfect because I love an oversized look. But y'all, this little skirt, it's, it's, it's like mini, it's short, okay? We are gonna see if it goes on, but it's true like flannel material, nothing like cheap looking and they make this in multiple y'all i didn't think i would like this but i ignore that sheer tank that turtleneck because that came from she and ain't no link down there for that but the set itself oh my god i love it with the jacket without the jacket wearing the jacket with jeans and it is actually like a wool material love it look at them tip them breasts I saw this just on the out. website i was like Ooh, this set is giving very auntie vibes and y'all know that's my goal in life to be the auntie that look so i got it oversized in my head oversized i got this in the xxl because i want to be able to tie the shirt up and do all types of fun stuff with it um and they make this set in uh multiple colors too i hope this one work y'all you need this one you need it now the only thing is only the blue came in an XXL, but they make it in other colors. I like it tied as a crop. My booty like a drop. That rhymed. I got bars. But it's like in when pajamas, but still cute. To me, of yes, get that Maxine, one. This little set. Y'all, look, it's a little vest and some super wide leg pants. And the crazy part is, y'all, I used to be in the club back in 2003 and 4 in business wear like this. Why the hell was I doing that? Okay, this one is in a size extra large and... I'm thinking that this is going to be one of my most favorite. It's given the Metro style catalog that came in the mail for your mom in 1998. Y'all, all jokes aside, I really do like that outfit. I really, I do. I was showing you that the vest is cut at an angle. And that vest is kind of tight. That middle button was kind of screaming out and, and for help. But the set itself, very, very cute, this y'all. This set actually came as a three-piece set. So you get these leggings. They, they look like they're going to be leggings. You get a overcoat and you get a little cami top. I got this one in a size extra large as well. Um, I'm not sure 
how this is going to go over. But we're going to see. The material on this is so super, super thick. So I'm hoping that this works because this the is material on this was very impressive. Okay. I want, look at them big black draws and their wig hanged up on my head like that. But the, oh, the set is very, very cute and flattering and thick. Look at me. I was feeling myself over there, knowing that them black draws were showing. And just praying that it works out. Cause I wanted this so bad, y'all. This little set. But the biggest size they had it in in this black and white color was a medium. I ain't been a medium since, you know, second grade when my mom was dressing me in Kato's clothes. Right? But we gonna, we gonna try it. Now they did make it in my size in a orange, burnt orange color, which would have been pretty too. But I just think that this set is going to be a bop if I can get it Okay, over. so the medium worked, but the set wasn't giving what it was supposed to give. The pattern wasn't flattering on me. I don't look like Harlequin. I, I look just like hard up. I, I didn't like the way the pattern, it, it widened me out. But it would be cute on somebody, but it just wasn't cute on me. It's so freaking pretty. First of all, I love this hot pink color right now. I don't know why I'm into it. I got this skirt in a size XL and it's satin, y'all. It is so pretty and then it has that vintage look to it. And like I told y'all, I like to thrift. It zips up the back. I'm gonna grab a, a tank or something to try this on with, but I think that this might be one of my most favorite. Y'all, I like this skirt. It just, I just wasn't sure. Look at that black tank top strikes again. Just sheer. The skirt is cute. I just didn't like how it hit on me. Like, I didn't know if it was supposed to be high-waisted, low-waisted. It was a little bit too big in the waist. But it's a beautiful skirt. It just wasn't giving very flattering on me. possible vibes, okay? Very cute. They button up the front. Again, I hate that they, the largest size they made them in was a large. Let's hope that I can, you know, get in them. It has this flat cargo pockets or on both sides. It has two sets. What the hell? No, one pocket works and then the other one just down there for decoration, but it's on both sides and the bottom are gathered. Let's gather. Let's, let's go see if we can gather up a tank top to try this on and look like him possible and not a hot mess. Y'all, I love these pants. They were a little big in the waist, but fitted everywhere else. Y'all, I absolutely love them. I would put a belt on with them and, and make them work. The top pocket works, the bottom pocket doesn't, but they are very, very fla <clears throat> flattering. Very flattering. I absolutely love all things vintage. So when I saw this collection that they dropped, y'all, I had to have them. So these are pants and I got them in a size large because that's the only size they went to. And I have a feeling they're gonna be too tight just cause I know my body so well around the hip part. But how cute and how vintage are, are these? Okay, and they're wide leg and they're linen. I'm gonna grab a tank to try these on, but I got a couple of pieces out of this collection. I, hope I hate that they made this collection with the larger size, a large. The pants went on, it's a size zip, but I'm showing you they sheer. Look at the tag over there to the right. It's a size zip. They went on. I wish they were a size bigger, but y'all, I love everything about this entire collection. I love those pants, even though they're a little tight. Quality, I love out of them. Any item in this whole haul. Now they had them in a large. Um, again, y'all know I like vintage and plaid, but they're gathered at the bottom with that button, and then they're like gathered up here at the waist part. And they are so heavy. Like they feel heavy uh, to keep you warm in the winter time. I'm nervous on if they gonna go on, on because I really, really- Y'all, these pants are in my top three most favorite thing in this whole haul. Look at that black turtleneck again. I'm showing them to you with a belt, with boots, with heels, so you can get an idea for how they look. They're giving when Sophia and Celie opened up the pants shop in color, pur color purple. I love these pants. Harpo want me in these pants. Love them. If you don't get nothing else, get them, sus. Collection that I've never tried on uh, Shein is the Shein Sexy Collection. I got them in extra large, and they are like the ultimate jeans for me. Okay, so they're tapered at the ends. 
and you got these cutouts that are already in them and these two the quality on these are really really nice like it's a heavy quality okay and i love that color y'all i felt myself in these pants baby i forgot to do three videos over there to the left i got them rolled up at the bottom over in that picture they uncuffed y'all these are the most flattering jeans i own now i 1000 percent recommend that you get these they so vintage the pleating in the front oh i love 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 love, love sexy those collection. i got this one in a size large just based off the reviews but y'all it's this mermaid y'all look at that Oof. mermaid skirt and it has buttons that actually work the buttons go all the way down they actually made this skirt in a darker denim as well but i went with the light denim and like i said this is in a Again, size with this stupid large. black turtleneck Y'all, this skirt was everything. I can say that it has tons of stretch. Look how big it is in my waist. So you can, I think, size down in this, but it was very, look, ooh. it is very flattering and you clearly can move around it. I've been eyeing this skirt on Shein for months, y'all, and they make it in multiple colors. And I finally just bit the bullet and I got it. I got this one in a size uh, zero X and I went with the black. It's like ruched on the side. Um, but they make this in that hot pink, a blue, green, yellow. Like if this works, I'm gonna go back and pick this up in multiple colors because um, it is, it is, it should be a pretty flattering skirt. That was a body. common theme in this haul. Stuff was too big in the waist for me. But the skirt, I put the belt on with it. Y'all, that skirt is everything if you get your right size. I, I say you can size down in that one most definitely. Very beautiful. Again, I hate saying this because sometimes it come back to bite me in the butt, but I think that this is gonna be one of my favorite pieces in this haul. I got this in a size large and it's not, why are y'all shiny like that? I'm gonna have to wipe off my camera. It's, um not just a plain button down white shirt because it comes with this big wrap that you can make a bow with. And I think that this is going to be an absolute bop and one of my favorites. And like I said, the possibilities the with this shirt are endless. That's three different ways I got that bow tied. I loved this. I just got it on with leggings there, but so many possibilities with this. So flattering too, and long enough to Again, cover your rump. color blocking, y'all, is just my thing. And I love colors that most people say wouldn't go together, putting them together. Like I like red and pinks. I like black and brown together. Like, so this is right up my alley. Um, This is also an example of how I purchased stuff on my own and she and send stuff because I purchased this on my own but she has sent me this cardigan that's in these same colors that'll uh, come down in a minute. The only size they had this in was a medium, um, but I, I'm still gonna love it. Also, I don't know if y'all can pick up on that, but it's like waffle knit material and it's thicker, it's heavier as well. And I love what these sleeves got going on. This one I think is gonna be, I think this one will be. I don't know why this top gave me 1980s Aspen sexiness. Like, I really like this top. Again, so many things you can do with it. You could tie it in the front, you could wear it open, you could wear it closed, you could belt this. I love this, and it's stay tuned because it's coming up in white and green too. Okay, so boom. When I saw this, I said I gotta have it. But y'all, I you know I'm transparent. I got really saggy boobies. So I'm not sure if it's gonna go over right. This is a, uh, a it's like a little crop top tank. Um. And it's made like a big bow in the front. Y'all, in my head, this would be cute. But we'll see. Um, regardless on if it looks good on me, I know this will look good on somebody. This is in a size large. I want to say they had an extra large too. But I went with the large to try to see if it could help. The tightness could hold my boobs up. Also, let me say this about that black bow top. You might be wondering, that's a, this a fall haul. Like, that's randomly in there. In my head, I can wear that under a blazer. Like, wouldn't that be a bob under a blazer or a denim shirt? That's me trying to justify that. It ain't okay, got so listen. At all. The shirt would work for somebody, just not me, y'all. It was real. That trench, I actually love it. It came from Shein. I put a link down there, too, but a long time ago. It was a cute top. It's just not for me. Where I'm going in there, right? But you can see, get the idea that this would work under like a blazer or a cardigan now, possibly. I, I probably should have saved this for the winter haul for like New Year's. Y'all look at this metallic shirt. 
It is so pretty in person, and I'm not sure how it's picking up on camera with that light, but this is part of Shein's Sexy Collection. I got it in a size large. The only thing I'm nervous about with this one as well, it's a huge drape, like it's collar, and then it's a huge drape in the front. So we gonna see. Y'all, this is one of my favorite pieces in this haul. There, I just got it on with some leggings and heels. This shirt was so stinking cute to me. I want to say that they also make it in silver, and I got to go have it because that's 1970s glam. I know this is going to be one of my favorite pieces, too. I got this one in a size medium because it was the only one they had. I shop clearance a lot, if you can't tell. Why the heck is y'all so blurry like that? I fix it. I said that earlier. I got this one, I'm lying, I ain't gonna fix it. This is in a size medium, and it's made just like the pink and red one earlier, except this one isn't waffle knit material. This one is um, more like a, just like a button down shirt material, but I love the colors on this. This is just like that pink and red one, it's just a different material. I absolutely love this one too. Look at that freaking turtleneck. Um, I love this one too. It's just uh, different colors, different materials, but again, long enough to cover your rump and it's cut at an angle, just like that pink and red one. So if I'm order, if I'm putting these in the order, I think I am. You remember that pink and red waffle knit shirt earlier? Uh, they make the, that same color combination, but in a cardigan with these big pork chop pockets in the front, y'all. And I am in love with this. It also fits heavy. I got this one in a size zero X because it's part of the Shein Plus collection. Um, this I know I will wear throughout the fall. Y'all, this was one of my favorite pieces in this whole haul because it's so vintage looking. I love the color contrast between the red and the pink. I love this cardigan and it's a thicker material too. It didn't feel cheap at all. 1000% recommend this one, boo. Now, the girl on the website was wearing this as a dress, but I know how I get down. I'm gonna wear this with like probably leggings, that's the millennial in me, or some jeans, but I'm gonna show it to you both ways. Um, I got this one in a size, it says a large. And those colors, y'all, how pretty is that? Y'all, I know I can't wear this, there's no dress. They like it stopping my belly button. I love this. I honestly wish that it was fitted like over there to the right. And I never, y'all know I like my stuff baggy. But a cute sweater nonetheless. But I do wish that it was tighter. See how much better it looks? Flattering. But it's cute, thick material as well. This is another one, y'all. The quality on this is just so nice. This is in a size extra large and it's an oversized sweater. And I, if you can't tell, I love an oversized or some off my shoulder look. Uh, but the quality on this is so nice. It's very thick. So this will definitely keep you warm. This ain't like one of them, you know, little thin ones that I normally get in a haul. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. This is really uh, thick, but it's part of a collection called Daisy, D-A-Z-Y. So let's if see. If you love a good oversized sweater, you 1000% need this one, y'all. It was so soft, so buttery. Look how long it is if I pull it over my hands, but it's cute as well. Just push back to the elbows. I'm just wearing it with some leggings and some heels. You know it's and I love that. Job never stop. That's a must. It says wife life and an extra large. Y'all know ain't a damn wife, but how cute is this gonna be? I think I wanna pair this with that black ruched skirt that I showed y'all earlier. Now this is a crop, okay? And you know, like I say, I eat crops and I wear crops. I'm gonna be big regardless, so why not? So, but I think it's really cute, y'all. And it is um, like a ribbed material on this. And they make this one in different colors too. For my wives out there, or if you a scammer like me. Y'all, why I got this shirt? Why I got this shirt? I'm wearing it with that skirt that was too big earlier. But I've seen if you can wear it off shoulder, you can't see this. Pull that up. It's like a ribbed waffle knit material. Super cute crop that's longer. I like a longer crop. Like I like a longer crop okay, like so that. So if you are normally too, on the channel short. for hair videos, just be prepared to see both of these shirts because I got it in black and white. And y'all, I really think it's going to be a bop. I got these in a size large. It's just hard for me to show it to you like this. 
Um, but they wrap peplum shirts. And I wish I would've got them a room too. Um, let me just go try it on, but be prepared because they off the shoulder. This, this is right up my alley. Oh, Lord, Since I this has been filmed, off. this shirt has been ordered in the maroon color, y'all. This is so flattering. So if you look, I'm showing you how you can tie it. But you can wear it off the shoulders like I have the black one in the middle. You can wear it on your shoulders. You can make it tighter, looser. Y'all, this shirt is just so flattering. Okay, so earlier when I showed you those linen pork chop pants with the color blocking on them, and I was like, I love them because they vintage. Y'all, these shirts, both of these, I'm gonna just do, do two at once. They are also part of that same collection, but again, the largest size they had was a large, and I know that's gonna be a little bit too tight, but y'all, look at that. I'm gonna look like J.J. Walker on Good Times, and y'all know that's my, that's my, that's my hope. Y'all, look how cute they are. But, like I said, the largest size they had were largest. Um, in real life, I would wear this with like either some wide leg jeans or under a jumper dress. So, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go grab something. I'm gonna try both of these. Actually, it's another shirt on here too. I'm gonna just, and it's part of the same collection. So, I'm gonna throw it in with that one. And again, this was in a size large. But y'all, look how cute. The designs were on this stuff. I just hope that it fits. So I'm gonna throw this one in there with the footage. These shirts are from the same collection with those color blocked pants. And y'all, I am in love. But y'all know I love vintage. Yeah, I'm in love with this stuff. I wish it was one size bigger, like an extra large. But the largest fit on, went on. They were just a little tight. Y'all, I love, I love, I cannot stress it enough. If you into vintage, you definitely need those. Don't act brand new, y'all know I'm country. Y'all look at this blazer with fringe. And it's baby blue, y'all. I'm so excited about this one now. It's in a size large. I wanna say that was the largest size that they had. Um, I think that this is, I think that this is a top. It might actually be a dress, but we gonna see y'all. This right up my, this right up my doggone alley. This was actually cute. It was just one size too big. And it is a blazer, not a dress. I love that fringe on that, y'all. But it was just one size too big. I should have gotten one size smaller and this would have been right up my alley. I love the extraness of it. It doesn't feel cheap. I can recommend that one, but get your so right size. Y'all, where's she going? Y'all, this is a dress, I think. It might be a top, we'll see. Y'all, it's crushed velvet with pearls all over it. <laughs> y'all, this... Where's she going? I'm like a church pew. I got this one in the size extra large. It's giving very Michael Jackson meets Liberace, which, yes ma'am, then bam, we'll see. We're gonna see, let me go try this This was on. giving Liberace meets church pew meets Miss Piggy meets RuPaul, which y'all know that's right up my alley. I love the extraness of this. Now I'm gonna be honest, I wouldn't wear like no dress like this because my hoo-ha was almost out. I would wear this as a, a blazer. I'm gonna jump out there again and say that this is gonna be one of my favorite way pieces. More expensive this is a than wrap dress, and I think for. just by the way that this is constructed, that it's going to be extremely flattering, y'all. This one is in a size extra large, a US a toy way off. This Y'all, right this dress again, was in my right. top three most favorite in this haul because it was so flattering. Now, it's a little thin. You can almost see my rump. It's thin, but so flattering and grown woman. Yes, y'all, get this one if you like wrap dresses. This is one of my favorites. I want to say top. The it might be my most favorite. It's also, y'all, really, really nice. It feels more expensive than what it was. I got this in a size large and it's a long, long, long maxi dress. It's given very vintage vibes, but it is really heavy. And I want to say it's lined up under here. Is it lined or is it? No, it's just really, it's got slits in it. Y'all, this was another one that felt way more expensive than what it retails for. Like this is something that you would find on my cloth and play, pay a pretty penny for it. You know, again, I'm into vintage fashion, so this was right up my alley. I love the slits, I love the extraness of the ruffles, and it was, I wanna say, lined the under there, too. And those beautiful, so a beautiful dress. Together, I got this in a size 
got this one in a 1X and it is a bodycon. Now this one is not inside out. That's the design on it and it is a ribbed material. It is, it got a lot of stretch to it. And it zips up the Y'all, this was cute. It just wasn't very flattering on my tum tum. And you know I'm gonna try all this on with no shapewear. But nice dress. It was a ribbed material. I love the design on it. But like I said, it was just wasn't flattering on my body type. We actually don't look bad, but I, I need a girl alone. I live for casting. Mm -hmm. And when I saw this one, and it was only like 12 bucks, I had to have it because, again, that classic pattern. Um, this is in a size 0X, but again, y'all, it's a caftan, so it's very, very forgiving. I wish they would. I could have gotten it in a smaller size. Um, I might have to belt it. If so, um, I put a link to where the belt is because I think I know which belt I'm Y'all, this bad boy was only $12. I hope that some of y'all were able to pick this up before it sells out because this felt like rich B tees. I loved everything about this caftan. Again, the quality okay, on that so one was very real life, nice. When I wear this, I would wear this with probably like a navy blue turtleneck under it. So if it's giving summer, just understand the bigger picture that I have for this. We gonna see. I got this one in a 1X. It was the um, smaller size they had. My biggest fear is that this might be see-through. We gonna see. But very pretty dress. It has buttons that go. I didn't think I was gonna like this because of the material, but it actually came out looking really cute. I put on these pink boots because I can remember if I showed y'all the footage. I bought those from Shein and I'm a sh those are definitely worth it. I'll put the link down there. I ain't even budding them up all the way. Dress cute. I love the way that whole outfit turned out. This was a dress that I wanted on my own because it is very like <laughs> vintage looking baby doll. I didn't realize it had these pearls on it when I ordered it. And to be honest with you, I might take those little pearls off. But this is a piece that feels more expensive than what it is. Um, I got this one in a size a large, but that is so cute to me. I wanna take them pearls off so Y'all, this dress was everything to me. It's lined. I didn't like the pearls on it. And I couldn't zip it all the way up because, you know, I'm a single girl. But this dress, the baby doll vintage look that it gave, Oh my gosh, y'all. It swings like that. Like, I no, love everything complete, about that dress. Pads. So this is a shoulder pad bodycon dress. They sell this in multiple colors, but when I clicked the link, I only saw black. But if you click on the black one, other colors will pop out in the suggestions that you could get. Um, I'm gonna jump out there and say that I think that this is gonna be pretty cute. I hope I won't regret that. I got this one in a size 1X. It's part of the Shein curve. Y'all, this was another basic staple dress that was really, really flattering. You can't see my tum tum in it. But the cut of this dress was this so This is a piece that I was kind of nervous because nice. I didn't know if I needed to get an extra large or XXL, but I went with the extra large because it has so much stretch. This is a denim jumpsuit. Um, I got it in a dark denim, but they make a lighter denim as well. This is also another piece that feels so much more expensive than what it is. It's really heavy denim. You got the zipper and you got buttons that go up the front. I don't I'm know excited. if I told y'all in the voiceover, but they make it in a lighter denim. Now, that button on my boobies was screaming out for pain, but y'all, this thing had a lot of stretch and it was really, really flattering. I should have sized up, in my opinion, one size, but it doesn't look bad at this size. The cut on this, the uh, this jeans is another, I think, and the quality the of that this one. This is a wrap that a uh, dress. Again, it is ruched in the middle. You can tell I know my body type. And it comes with this wrap around bow that you can make. Um, and I got this in an extra large. This poplin material is so nice. I really should iron this before I show it to y'all, but y'all know I'm not. I'm gonna show it to you just how you gonna get Just it. like with that black and white top earlier, the possibilities on how you style this dress are endless. I love that they have the ruching up there on the hips because it gives the illusion of a smaller waist. Um, also notice that there isn't a button there where the bow, the ties meet up, but the dress itself, good quality and very I flattering. I wish y'all could feel this because it's so buttery soft and it has a lot of stretch to it. This is a leopard print dress that I got in a 1X. It's part of that Shein Curve collection and it's a bodycon as well. But to be honest with you, like 
you could wear this with a kimono, you could wear this with a blazer. Um, of course, I'm gonna show it to y'all just by itself, but I think that this one is going to be flattering as well because of the way they constructed it. See how it even jut out at the this hip This dress had so already. much stretch to it. It was really cute and buttery soft. Like I could, like the the material on this, it wasn't, didn't feel like a cotton. Like it was very, very soft. I love this one, and they make this it in other colors and prints too, y'all. This dress is a part of collection with those tops and those pants that, you know, unfortunately the largest size they had was a large. So I know, even before I try this on for y'all, I know it's gonna be too tight around the midsection um, because of the way it's constructed. It doesn't have a lot of stretch to it, but the concept is so pretty. Maybe it could be my motivation dress. I'm lying, I'm frying pork chops tonight. This is another piece from that little vintage collection that they carry. The largest they went up to is a large. Y'all, I love this so much. I just needed one size bigger because the construction of this, the stripes, the vintage looking collar, the puff sleeves, put this right up my alley. It was just one size too little. This dress is a plaid oversized tunic dress. Um, It's heavy. It feels wool, like wool. But I have a feeling this is gonna be too big, so I'm going to have to grab a belt to wear with it. But it is a very nice material. It doesn't feel cheap at all. It feels woolen. Let's hope I don't like a This dress one. screams going to a pumpkin batch, a haunted house, stealing out of Target. Like this dress screams just fall. I love it. I love it better, I'm gonna be honest with you. Belted, but unbelted is cute too. Very relaxed, you know. Cute little fall, little, little, little look. I did get um, three pair of shoes. They're all in a size nine. I got these hot pink vintage looking boots. I don't know, I, I might be giving street walker. So you will see these in the hall in a size nine. I got these classic nanny friend sock little booties. Notice the heels are, sl uh, are small and chunky because I, I like my comfort now. And then I got, now these on, I got these. Actually, they ain't that bad, okay? And these have like a croc pattern on it. Can y'all see that? Um, and like I said, they're all size 41 or nine. So you'll see these in um, the hall. I'm gonna tell you how comfortable. Y'all, those little hot pink boots and those black ones are a must. I actually didn't wear the white and black ones in this hall, but I will later. They are very comfortable too. I'm a nine, ordered a nine in all three, and I love, love, love all them. All right, so I'm gonna jump out there and say that out of all 40 plus pieces that we tried on, just me looking at them, 95 to 98% of that stuff I absolutely liked. And that is why I order a lot from Shein on my own, uh, because they do have unique pieces. If I'm not thrifting, I'm going um, to Shein. If you look in the description box, you'll see a coupon code. Use it as you subscribe. Also in the comments, y'all know that helps me. Tell me what's another like, do you wanna see like theme hauls? We've done uh, a sleepwear haul, we've done a bathing suit haul, we did a sundress haul. Do you like it when it's themed like this or do you like it when it's just random stuff, okay? I tried to stick to fall in this one. I hope that y'all enjoyed some of these pieces and you saw some that you like. Like I said in the comments, tell me which were your faves. Until next time, which will be very soon. Bye. <laughs>